uh, dejo uh, unos mensajes en inglés, entonces no los pude entender. Uh, ¿Puedes decir qué dicen? Ah, uh, sí, claro. Good morning. My name is Sherry Smith and I'm the school guidance counselor. Uh, I was hoping to speak with the mother or father of Felipe Gomez. It looks like Mr. Gomez skipped school for the fifth time this semester. Several of the seniors actually skipped school today for an impromptu beach rave. <laughs> Um, so if you could please give us a call as soon as you can. This is obviously an urgent matter, as we want to make sure Felipe finishes up his senior year as smoothly as possible. Bye-bye now. Take the head on. Uh, um, la escuela quería recordarnos que ensayo de graduación es el próximo sábado. Oh, estoy tan nerviosa. <laughs> Mi niño inteligente y honesto. <laughs> Creo que hay un otro mensaje. Genial. Yes, hi. This call is for the parent or legal guardian of Felipe Gomez. My name is Richard Brockman, and I'm the school principal, and I'm sure you heard about the student's alcohol-fueled rager at the beach today. <laughs> well, it turns out Felipe and the other students were found murdering at the beach rave, <laughs> so none of them will be graduating <laughs> because of the murdering. Please call us back whenever you get a moment. This is obviously less urgent as the person who was murdered is already dead. <laughs> uh, que tengo que recoger mi banda porque estoy graduando con honores. Entonces me dan una banda especial. Oh, mi niño lindo! Eso es maravilloso! Tu padre y yo estamos felices. Ok, un otro mensaje. Fantástico. Yes, hi, this is for the family of Felipe Gomez. Yeah, my name is Pete McGuire, and I'm the school gender. Just uh, calling about the beach murder from this morning. <laughs> Turns out the students tried to <laughs> dispose of the body by dragging it to the bottom of the ocean. And it was uh, <laughs> actually going pretty well, but... Then the blood attracted a beautiful family of great white sharks. Now, normally this wouldn't be a problem, but the students were in fact high on marijuana. And uh, they thought it'd be funny to bring the sharks back to the school. <laughs> so apparently they used some nets to scoop the sharks out of the water and then drove the sharks to the school and tried to hide them in the swimming pool. <laughs> but that's when the sharks started fighting back. And you know, Felipe actually managed to subdue a couple of sharks, so uh, he was uh, pretty helpful. But some folks said they saw him run out with one of the sharks like some kind of trophy, so uh, we are a little concerned. <laughs> anyway, the point is, the student's loss at the school is now run by sharks. But if you want to give me a call, a I am available. <laughs> this is not an urgent at all, but uh, as the man investigating the murders was eaten by sharks, and the school year is pretty much over, so uh, leap bait, hey, not even in trouble. But uh, if you ever want to chat, uh, I do get lonely sometimes. <laughs> sharks don't talk much. <laughs> all right, y'all have a good one. <laughs> uh, eso se trataba de, de graduación. Uh, uh, ¿Dijeron algo de marihuana? Sí, no se puede fumar marihuana en la graduación. Ah, por supuesto. Ok, un último mensaje. Hi, this is Sandra Thompson. Just calling for Mrs. Gomez. Uh, she's taking my English as a second language class, and I just had a quick update. <laughs> She's failing the class. <laughs> <laughs>